Hi, I'm Rusty Cooley. Welcome to my Licks and Concept course. In this course, you're going to find a bunch of new licks and concepts that are really going to help push your playing to the limits. You're going to learn new ways to alternate pick and concepts for harmonic content, ways to play over different chords, and new ways to approach and think about chords and scales. And just expand your playing as a guitar player. And as a guitar player, you always want to continue to grow and keep learning. Basically, in the course, you have your licks of your concepts, and the concepts are how you approach using this stuff melodically in a chordal context. The licks are great ideas that you can use and examples so that you can dig right into the concepts. So once you absorb what the concept is, well, here's several ideas that you can use to apply to this one concept. One of the most important things to do is once you start to get some of these licks and concepts to your fingers and in mind, is to start using them immediately. So if you have some way to record yourself playing guitar, you know, do it. Record using some of the, uh, from some of the scales, like in B Phrygian Dominant. Um, you want to dig in, create a little bit of rhythm, or you could even create a one chord vamp. Even if you're a more advanced player, you don't have to be a beginner to apply this. It's sometimes I'll tell my students, just play the notes of the scale, don't improvise. This is not about improvising as much as it is to listen to how each note is affecting the chords so you can get more familiar with how to pull certain ideas from the tonality. So a lot of times, even me, no matter what level you get at, new chords, new scales, at some point I'm just listening. So the idea is when you start learning and creating this stuff and being creative, it doesn't all have to be this brilliant solo as much as it is an exploration of sound so you can start to hear what it is that you're trying to do and where you're going. All of the examples in this course are tabbed and notated and we're going to include them with guitar profiles as well. All right, enough talk. Now it's time to get down to action. Get out your guitar, tune it up, plug it in, crank it up, and let's get to ripping.